Hello all, welcome back to another video. Uh, today the paper I've chosen is 2023 specimen uh, 02. So we'll look into documentation today. So let's start with task one, which is the evidence document. So I have the evidence document open here. Okay, now here in the evidence document, make sure that your name, center number and candidate number will appear on every page of this document. So it is either a header or a footer you will add it. So I choose it to be on the header, insert tab, header, and type in your name, center number, and your candidate number. Just header and footer. And then let's save this evidence document in our folder with the file name SP02 Evidence. So file, save as, save it as Word document with the file name SP02 followed by your candidate number. Save. Okay, moving on to task two, document, you are going to edit a report for Tawara Yach Brokers. The company uses a corporate house style for all their documents. Paragraph styles must be created and applied as instructed. Okay, let's begin. Using a suitable software package, open the file SP02 Super. Okay, we have it here, the file. The page setup is set to A4 landscape orientation with two centimeter margin do not make any changes to these settings so no changes to that save the document in your work area with a file name broker file save as change the format to word document and the file name to broker Okay, make sure it is saved in the format of the software using. Make sure the format is set to Word document. Place in your evidence document a screenshot to show the file has been saved. Make sure there is evidence of the file type. Okay, let's go to the folder and click on broker. Make sure the file type is fully visible before you take the screenshot. Screen on the keyboard. Open your evidence document and place this under step one, evidence one, and crop the picture. Okay, moving on to the next step. Place in the footer of the file broker. Let's open the broker file and insert footer, three column. On the footer, automated page numbers left aligned. On the left, highlight the placeholder on the left, page number, current position plane number. You got the footer there. Your name, center number and candidate number right aligned. Highlight the placeholder on the right and type in your name, your center number, followed by your candidate number. Delete off the placeholders which are not used. Close header and footer. That's it on the footer. Make sure all the alignments, this is to check. Huh? We're going to check if all the alignments match the page margin. No other text is included in the header and footer area. The footer is displayed on all the pages. Just double check if all these criteria are met. Okay, now continuing. Create and store the following, para uh, following styles. Okay, let's start with creating the style. All right, basing each on the default paragraph style. So to create a style under home tab from the style list, choose create a style. Type in the name of the style. The first style is ty subhead. ty 
subhead modify set the style type to be paragraph ba based on to be normal or default and then font style sans serif set the font style to be arial font size 16 change the font style size to be 16 center aligned align center and then enhancement set it to be all capitals with bold set bold for all caps go to format font and effects check the box for all caps click ok and then line spacing is single before is zero after is nine so format paragraph single line spacing leave it to be single before is zero after is supposed to be nine point okay so here you were supposed to take a screenshot to show that you have defined the settings for t y subhead style okay so make sure you take the screenshot before you click ok print screen on the keyboard and then click ok on both the windows open your evidence and paste this under step three evidence to and crop the picture to show the formatting clearly and enlarge the picture okay back to broker so we are done with the first one now creating the next style tyb table from the style list create a style type in the style name tyb table modify style type to paragraph based on to normal default serif font we choose it to be times new roman leave it to be set it to be times new roman font size is 11 set the font size to be 11 alignment is again to be in the center center align enhancement italic apply italic to get it line spacing single zero before zero after so format paragraph single line spacing both has to be zero okay 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 now display these custom styles style names as a list in the style manager so to get the list of styles in the style manager you click on this arrow here the style list and take a screenshot of this and paste it in your evidence document under step 4 evidence 3 and crop the picture to just show the style list okay, next so the screenshot is done step 5 the style name ty title has already been created stored and applied so make sure the title has ty title style applied to it because we're going to format that modify the ty title style so that only the following formatting is applied so to modify you right click on the style modify uh, the style type is supposed to be format uh, font style is sans serif set it to be arial font size is 32 increase the font size to 32 and then alignment is center enhancement bold and underline center align enhancement is not italic it only has to be bold and underline single line spacing spacing before is zero after is six so format paragraph single line spacing before is zero after is supposed to be six point take a screenshot of these windows click ok open evidence paste this under so you're supposed to show the evidence right yeah place the evidence in the evidence document screenshot of the style setting first ty title style to show that you have changed these okay let's paste under step 5 and crop this picture to just show the formatting the editing done for the ty title style okay now back to broker 
below the title add the subtitle so place the cursor enter once and type in the subtitle draft report by draft report by followed by a colon followed by your name type in your name and then the style name ty subtitle has already been created and stored apply this style to the text you entered in step six step six is the draft report by followed by your name highlight that and apply ty subtitle Okay, next change the page layout so that the subheading global analysis and all the following text is displayed in two equally spaced column with two centimeters spacing between the columns so from global analysis highlight all the following text and go to the layout tab choose columns more columns choose the number of columns to be two and spacing is supposed to be two centimeter okay there you have it next identify subhead five subheadings in the document and apply ty subhead style to each one of them so five subheadings global analysis one business review two sales three charters four and conclusion five so go to home tab in the style list apply ty subhead style okay next locate the table in the document sort okay let's locate the table first there we have the table here highlight the table the entire table we'll apply borders to it so that it's easy for us to do the formatting to the table so from the borders list choose all borders okay sort the data in the table into descending order of length in meters so let's highlight the range from Germany until United States of America the number of yachts sort you have the option to sort here A to Z click on that option you're sorting by column 2 because we are asked to sort by length in meters which is in the second column leave the type to be number because it's numbers there and it's ascending order we're supposed to sort I mean descending order so choose descending order and then click OK the sorting is done next insert a new row between Germany and UAE so place the cursor in Germany right click insert insert rows below you have the new row there type in the enter the following data into this new row so the first one the name of the country is china and then length in meters 900 number of yachts 26 926 next apply ty table style to this table highlight the entire table and apply ty table style make sure no data is wrapped within the table so make sure the table doesn't have any text wrapped when two lines okay it has to be in one line so adjust the column size of the table but make sure it doesn't go beyond the column text are in one line now next display grid lines when printed so we have added already the borders highlight if you haven't added highlight the table from the border list choose all borders now we already have the borders now next all borders and data fit within the column as i told you the data the table should not go beyond the column it has to be within the column there is a six point space after the table so after the table is going to be before this paragraph so place the cursor there right click paragraph spacing before set it to be six point click ok so you get the space after the table format the first row of the table to be center aligned over the three columns so we'll have to merge the cells first highlight the first row 
right click merge cells and then make sure it is aligned to the center of the cell import the image sp02 yarch and place this below the subheading charters so find for the subheading charters place the cursor before the content enter once and move the cursor up and insert pictures from your device find go to your folder and find for the picture sp02 yach insert you have the picture there reflect the image so the yach points to the left so under picture format rotate flip horizontal rotate flip horizontal now the arch is pointing towards the left next format the image so that it is resized to the width of six centimeter maintaining the ratio the ratio make sure it is locked here it is mostly by default locked and then change it to six centimeter type the width to be six cm and then it has to be aligned to the left column and at the top of the paragraph starting a Tavara Yaj charter. Make sure it is on the left hand side of the column and above the text, it has to be above the text a Tavara Yaj charter. Next, text wraps round the image. For wrap text, you go to picture format, click on the picture though, click on the picture first, picture format, wrap text choose square there's still one empty line place the cursor before the text backspace once so that it's fully wrapped spell check and proofread the document so for spelling and grammar it is under review tab check if there are any changes to be done Okay, make sure it is all checked. Okay, so it's done all. And then finally, you'll have to double check all of these. The table is not split over two columns or two pages. The table has to be within one column and within one page. And then no widows or orphans are there. Make sure there are no widows and orphans. Mm, this is considered, this could be considered as a widow. So you extend the size of the table so that you have more than one line here on the next column. No blank pages. Make sure there are no blank pages in the document. Styles are applied consistently and the spacing must be consistent between all the items. Make sure all the spacings are correctly applied save the document using the file name and the format used in step one so make sure you save it with the same file name which you saved in the first step and the format also has to be saved so that's the end of this document once done you will have to print the document you will go to file print choose the correct printer's name and click on print so I hope that was clear. So we'll stop with this. See you guys in the next video with a new task. Thank you. Bye-bye.